Hi, my name is Tim Cunningham. I am with Forest River, Berkshire, Charleston, Diesel Motorhome Division. Here today to show you our brand new 2023 Berkshire XL 40E. With the Berkshire XL platform, you're gonna have 380 horsepower. Uh, you're gonna have a 3000 Allison transmission built on the Freightliner chassis. One of the unique things about the Berkshire XL is it's one of the only non-tags in the industry that actually has 15,000 pounds of towing. Um, even if you don't need all that towing, you get rear disc brakes, so a little bit longer lifespan. So really overall, the equipment platform of the Berkshire L is almost on match for you know, what it has to offer. So transitioning over here into the front of the unit, uh, with the Berkshire XL, uh, all the 41 footers are gonna have a 10K generator on the front because you have three 15K ACs. There is a Berkshire 37A that has uh, an 8K gen that has this nice slide out tray here on the front. Um, here on the front again, you're going to have these nice kind of butterfly style uh, windshield wipers. Gets you pretty good, you know, coverage and clearance and, and wipage, uh, you could say, on your, uh, your windshield there. Um, transitioning it around again, you have this nice high quality paint job. Um, we do have all new brand new paints for uh, 2023 in the Berkshire XL. Um, but to protect that, we have this nice name brand Diamond Shield front protective mask that really helps in terms of uh, the front of your unit. Again, you're going to see our standard Berkshire Charleston style drop down mirrors. Uh, those are going to give you really good coverage and clearance in terms of uh, you know your visibility and things like that. The cameras are going to be in the mirrors at that point. Uh, you turn on a turn signal it's going to pop up on your center radio uh, in the cockpit up there. Um, one of the standard features across our lines uh, is you're going to have this nice 30 inch entryway. Uh, you're going to have this very solid rigid door. I always mention it because again it really helps dampen that air noise as you're traveling down the road. Uh, you're going to have your standard keyless entry feature here. Uh, with the Berkshire XL, you're going to have a 100-gallon fuel tank. Uh, it is going to be a dual fill capabilities on either side. It is a locking aspect to it as well. Coming over here then too, you're going to have this nice big full wall slide. Um, again, it's going to be hydraulic style of power. Uh, you're going to have a nice dual stage, uh, dual pitch uh, awning that gives you really good you know, clearance and coverage uh, for your campsite. Getting into the first compartment here, again, you're going to have your nice uh, storage shelving trays. Uh, you're going to see some extra tile in there. We always give you an extra box of tile that comes from the same cut, same thing. I always point out, too, you know, the rigidity and the sturdiness of the baggage doors. Uh, they're very well insulated. Um, again, very well sealed. Helps keep everything safe and whatnot down below. Here, you're going to have your nice full slide, slide out tray. Again, that is going to come out on either side all the way for you. Um, so a really good functional practical. Here you're going to have your nice exterior entertainment center, a nice 43 inch smart TV, nice sound bar. Again, more storage. You know really the size of this storage bay on the 40E, you could probably put another slide out tray if you so chose to. More storage. Here is going to be your Passenger side aspect in terms of it gives you access to your holding tanks, your fresh, your gray, uh, and your black as well. Trying to make it again as user as a friendly coach, so you have you know good access to pretty much everything. Again, you're going to have more storage, uh, but you're also going to have your equalizer controls here for your hydraulic systems. So for your hydraulics of this big slide, and then again your leveling system because you have hydraulic power up and down. One of the unique new features for 2023 on the Berkshire XL product. Um, is the chassis structure that we got from Freightliner. Um, so really, typically, you know, on an aspect in terms of your, your service intervals, your engine oil, things like that, um, you know, they're going to be located on the rear area by the radiator. Um, Freightliner has now been able to put them in a centrally located spot over here. Really helps in terms of, you know, service work, convenience. You have your chassis batteries here. Um, but it's a unique aspect because uh, Freightliner is trying to make it as, again, serviceable as possible for, you know, the customers and for everybody. Uh, Forest River is exclusive on this art chassis, so you won't find this chassis anywhere else in the marketplace uh, for a couple years at least. So it's a pretty cool opportunity for us. Again, coming here to the rear, you have your standard rear mount radiator. 
Um, again, like I said, with the Berkshire XL being unique, having up to 15,000 pounds of towing, and then you have your brake sync system as well, which is cool. Uh, that's going to be for your air braking of your tow vehicle. So really trying to maximize it for you to have that peace of mind and, and comfort and, and ease, you know, having to towing, having to braking for your tow vehicles or whatnot. Um, it's all in there. So, um, you know, when you have 15,000 pounds of towing, you still have 7,000 pounds of cargo capacity. So, you know, we're not, we went a little heavier on our axles to give you the most bang and flexibility. Getting over here. Uh, now you're going to have your 2800 watt pure sign inverter um, from Magnum. Uh, new for 23, there is this optional power cord reel that you're going to have here. Um, awesome deal. It is a powered, powered cord reel as well. Coming over here, you're going to have your six, six volt house batteries. Uh, there is a disconnect switch in there for you as, as well. And now you're going to have your driver's side 13 gallon diesel exhaust fluid uh, tank and then there is an area for storage for your sewer hose. I always call this the bread and butter area uh, kind of of four server diesels. This is our individual water manifold system. So what that means is you're going to have a point to point connection between your cold lines and your hot lines as it goes into the unit. You're not going to have a cold line and a hot line that goes in and starts to tee. We've been doing this for a long time and you know this is really going to help in a floor plan like this because the 40E is a two-fold bath bunkhouse wardrobe. So having those two showers and having individual lines running to it, really now because of the size of the water pump, you're going to be able to take two showers at once if you so chose to. And then worst case scenario, one of the showers maybe gets a leak, you're able to come over here and just isolate it, continue on with your trip, you're not wasting your you know, vacation or whatnot. You have a whole house water filtration system here. Um, there's a valve down here for you to be able to switch between your city, your black tank flush uh, for just running off the tank. Uh, because, and then this is where your black tank is as well, uh, flush, drain. It is on a rotator so you can flip it up when you're not using it. Then over here you have a nice control panel that's going to show your tank levels. You can turn on and off your cargo lights um, with the precision circuit system so you're not having to run back and forth inside the, the house just maybe to take uh, check your tank levels. The Berkshire XL 40E is a quote unquote all electric coach. Um, it's not going to have any propane on it. It's going to be used in the 250D aqua hot system. Uh, that's going to help heat your, um, your water and then kind of your, your furnace perspective. It uses a boiler system. Uh, it gives it a little bit more of a moist, clean, I'd say heat too. So a little bit better for breathing purposes. Again, now you're going to be on the driver's side aspect of the storage. You see that there is a dirt double system. We do have a central vac. For 23, we did add a nice little toe kick, so you kind of got uh, a little flexibility there. More storage. And then even more storage. Now, standing here inside the cockpit of the Berkshire XL 40E, you're going to feel it's very spacious. Again, you got your nice 30 inch entryway over here. Um, you're going to have a nice passenger workstation tray over here for the passenger. Uh, if you're going down the road, it's kind of multi-purpose and practical, functional. Um, and over here in the cockpit area, the driver's side, you're going to see a really ergonomically, uh, visually friendly in terms of, you know, we want to make sure that you have ease of access and reach to all your controls. Um, again, trying to make it as comfortable for you driving down the road. So with your OptiView screen from, from Freightliner, you have a lot of the hands-free controls here on your steering wheel. Some of those tie into uh, the radio here. But then again, you don't have to reach far to get to some of the buttons that you have over here between the horn, um, your radio lights, and things like that. Um, you also have then the power uh, button for the powered foot or uh, foot rest um, tray that comes out over here for uh, the passenger. And then again, you're going to have your equalizer controls over here. That's going to be for your hydraulic leveling jacks. You do have a wireless cell phone charger, and then you do have your uh, engine brake release over here your park brake release, excuse me. As you move further back in here too, you're gonna see again our standard feature, our nice cockpit drop down bed. Um, again, it's really hidden, you know, being six feet tall. Um, it has a 500 pound weight limit. Um, so again, it gives you a little bit extra sleeping. It looks, you know, cosmetically appealing, um, but you don't even know it's there. And then again, you got your nice ladder. Moving into the, the living kitchen portion of the 40E, um, again, kind of starting here in the front, you're going to see your nice big Samsung French door residential refrigerator. 
One of the new cool features is, is you got this nice water dispenser here as an automatic refill. And then you have your nice oversized ice maker down here. There's a nice scoop for it. So it just looks a little sleeker, a little bit more modern residentially. Uh, you're gonna be seeing our executive dark cherry kind of white diamond package here in the Berkshire XL. Um, but again, with the 40E, now you're, again, you're gonna get a little bit more. It's a comparable floor plan as our Berkshire 40F, um, but you're just gonna have a couple extra bells and whistles on top of the engine features that we talked about earlier. You're gonna have nice villa furniture. Um, it's gonna have heated floors throughout. Uh, new for 23 is we added it all the way to the rear uh, bathroom. Um, and then uh, you get a little bit more of that little, you know, glitzy light uh, that is dimmable. Um, pretty nice little touch, you know, kind of fits the vibe of what we want to be. Um, you know, trying to not be too much, but give it a little bit of flair. Your nice induction cook, uh, cooktop, your convection microwave. Again, you have your nice dishwasher down here. A very large, oversized... Um, farmhouse style sink. There are some pretty cool add-on options that you can get. Strainer, cutting board, things like that. But again, with the 40E, plenty of countertop space. You do have a nice pop-up receptacle over here. Uh, plenty of storage down below. With your nice big TV here, you get plenty of storage behind and there is a safe back there. Nice sound bar up here. So it really gives you a good viewing area, you know, for your sofa over here. The sofa will lay flat, you know, it is about six feet um, in overall length there. So, you know, you can maybe fit two or people or so. Again, you have your nice uh, oversized booth. It does turn into a bed and there is, you know, good storage down below. And that'll be on either side for you. And then up here, you're going to have plenty of depth. Nice quality cabinetry, real cherry. And then there are all these nice soft clothes. Uh, door glides. As you're moving back into the central part, again, you're going to have some more storage up here and down below. And then as you get into here, you're going to have what I always say is your oversized wardrobe bunk space. It's really a utility aspect in terms of it. You can flip it up and you have your hanging wardrobe bar here. You have your bunks. Each bunks have a nice TV in there as well for uh, who's sleeping in there. But, you know, again, you can put dog kennels in there. You can put bikes. You can put all sorts of different things in there. So it is a multi-purpose style of room, I would say, because you have these nice trifold doors that, that fold there. You Getting into the center part again, the 40E being two full bathrooms, you know, you do have a nice size bathroom in here. You're not compromising the size of the center shower. Sometimes in order to get there, the shower size is a little bit smaller. Um, but, you know, again, this is pretty comfortable for me in here at that point. Again, we talked about the water manifold system um, really helping this aspect. You also have your shower miser system here. Again, with two showers, you know, you don't want to waste water. So it'll help circulate that water, gets it up to temperature. And then at that point, you can turn it on so you're not really wasting any of that water. Moving into the back in the bedroom. Again, for 23, we added the nice tilt of view bed. Gives you plenty of space in here um, when you're not sleeping. Again, you can sleep or sit up in that aspect of it too. But it really just opens it up, I would say, a lot. You know, with your TV here, you got nice storage behind it. Plenty of drawer space down below. Plenty of wardrobe space up here for hanging clothes. You got your nice, you know, full-size mirror there. Uh, again, as you move into the back bathroom, another full bathroom again. You got your washer and dryer, you got your rear macerator toilet, um, you know, nice vanity area over here. One of the cool things now that's new for 23 is again, we made the shower size a lot larger over here. So you're going to have kind of a seated bench over here, but you got plenty of elbow room. Um, again, I would say I would be hard pressed to find another shower so large. You know, it's one of the creature comforts that you might have had at home and that's just our goal overall of trying to provide you the most comfortable experience as you're traveling down the road as well we really want you to be able to come from home and feel comfortable it's kind of where we style you know the aesthetics giving you the heated floors uh really you know priding ourselves on trying to give you everything that you want and need and then some um you know trying to have the best bang for the buck 
and having a, a good family oriented style of the coach with the bunks, the two full baths and a little bit of that, you know, flexibility in terms of it overall. Certainly hope you learned a lot today about our Berkshire XL 40E. Have any questions, please don't hesitate to call Forest River or uh, we can help find you, you know, your local dealer and um, hopefully we can get you some uh, questions answered. Thank you.